In this video, we will show you how to align W to a feature. So for this example, we have a cylinder and we'll use a circle to align W. So we're starting off by measuring the width of the cylinder. And we will use these two lines that we have constructed to create a gap. So we're so we will select gap in both lines. And now we will make a system and skew to one of these lines. And we will make an X origin in the gap. So we are aligning X along the center of the gap, which is the center of the cylinder. Now we will go find the circle that we will use to align. And as you will see, the circle is a little bit offset from the center. So it's not, it's not sitting at the top center of the cylinder. So we will go ahead and before measuring the circle, we will take uh, one focus point So we select point, the focus point vision tool, and we will place it close to the circle. For good practice, we will create a system Z origin using this focus point. Now we will go ahead and measure the circle feature using an F-scan arc tool. So we will place the vision tool on the screen. And next we will select the calculator feature. And now using the trigonometric functions, we will do the arc sign of the X value, the X displacement of the circle, divided by the width divided by two. The width divided by two is the radius of our cylinder. So once we do that, we will calculate the angle that we need to move in W in order to place this circle at the top center of the cylinder. So in order to do that, we will first create a system and use the calculator result as an offset. And as you will be able to see, the DRO W value will change to negative 13, which is the angle we just calculated. Now to align, to make W zero, we will right click on the camera window and select move to and enter zero absolute in W. So you will be able to see that the circle now aligns perfectly to the top center of the cylinder. And now you can continue to measure the rest of the program knowing that you have a W0 alignment.